Hello my crafty friends and welcome back to my channel and another month of 10 on the 10th which is a Christmas card collaboration hosted by Kim of Metal Scrap and Chick. Every month we make 10 Christmas cards or they're about 7 to 12. Some people make 20 and that's great because it means that's a lot less hair pulling that we're going to be doing around the holidays. I only made nine cards this month because at some time my brain was telling me, okay, Nikki, just stop and shoot the video. <laughs> so that's what I'm doing. I made nine full cards inside and outside. And what I did, and this is my goal moving forward, especially for this collaboration, is to use all my scrap paper from my past Christmas projects. I have three containers full and whatever's on the top I start with first and then work my way down and hopefully get through some of that scrap paper and it's a good incentive because I want to try to do this before I start anything new. I did just get my vintage Christmas 12 by 12 and that was inspired by Beth of Bourbon Creek Crafts. So like I said, I've got to try to use up my other scrap paper first. And then I also used, I ended up using three different sets. On the Star of Light set, I used the dies. And on this set, I used the piece on Earth. And on this set, I used Blessed Christmas Wishes and the Star Cluster. So let's get started. All right. I use the sentiment strips, or not sentiment, well, basically they are, they're strips. And then just whatever pieces I had at the top of my container. So this is a cut apart I used. It just popped up on foam tape, the background, blue background. And this is matted with vanilla. Okay, this is Night of Navy to go with this. And then this, I decided to use Tranquil Tide because this right here looked kind of like a cross between Night of Navy and Tranquil Tide. I used Tranquil Tide for the piece on earth and the inside. And this is one where I used the star and it got stuck, so I had to fix that. But I also used my Nouveau Drops, if you can tell. This was the, the Crystal Drops, the Shimmering ones and then the, whoops I did not put a sentiment in here oh okay and this is where I used another one of the the dies the same one but I also used the that star cluster in the night of Bethlehem set to make that because this had so much sentiments on it already and this is also a cut apart use the doves background some gold paper and then this again another tranquil tide inspired piece this one does have a sentiment in it and the blue background again the stars piece on the earth Popped up on foam tape. Tranquil Tide. And last but not least, I saw this in my, in the bunch of strips I had cut out. And so I cut this in half. Hallelujah. And then the piece on earth. Okay. There are my cards for this month. Next month, I will be looking at what's underneath that for my scraps and working with that. And either one of these stamp sets or another one. The list of collaborators is down below if you haven't had a chance to see them all yet. Thank you for joining me. Have a wonderful day.